Hi, I'm Rachel, a certified running coach, and this is Becky. We're from the TJH Health and Wellness Center. We'll show you a few stretches to do after running to keep you moving freely. Lunges are great for the hip flexors, quads, hamstrings, glutes, and calves, and are especially effective as a cool down following your run. First will be a front lunge with a high knee variation. Step to the front, keeping the leg in line with the hip. Then bend both knees so that you have three 90 degree angles, or what we will call triple flexion. Front leg, hips, and back leg. Next, drive the heel of your back leg to the ground, straightening your back leg. Try to keep the front leg from changing its position, but it's okay if it does slightly. Next, lift up to a high knee and then step forward again on the alternative leg to repeat the movement on that leg. Complete five lunges on each leg. Another movement that's great for runners is the lateral lunge. As runners, we continually move in a linear plane, so the lateral plane unfortunately gets neglected. The lateral lunge helps to balance our stride while maintaining good mobility in the hips. From a standing position, step out to a comfortable position. Bend your left knee while keeping your right straight, allowing your glutes to go more into a sitting position. Remember to keep your head and chest up. Now switch from bending your left knee to bending your right knee while straightening your right. Hold each side for two to five seconds, then switch again so that you have held each lunge five times. Then just stand up and shake out your legs. Two important points here is to try and keep your toes pointed forward as much as possible. A bit turned out is okay, but it's best to keep them pointed forward as much as possible. The second tip is to really allow your hips to release at the bottom of the stretch as you gain flexibility. Thank you for joining us. We hope these tips will help you stay injury free. Enjoy your run.